Hey everyone, I'm coming to you today to show you these hair extensions that I got from Nappy Hair Extensions. They sent me a pack of clip-in 18-inch natural straight clip-in extensions to review on my channel. So of course I put all the information about this company in the exact clip-in extensions that they sent me below. But first I'm going to talk about how I styled these extensions and then I'm going to... Um, talk about what I thought about them so first thing that I do is I just begin to part my hair in the back and then I'm going to pin up the rest of my hair um, in the front and so I take the first piece that I felt fit the most you need to measure it um, if you don't know the best size and you want to have the clips open and then close them right on the part of your hair and so you do this over and over again, as you'll see me doing in the video. And like I mentioned, if you don't know the size piece to use, because the pieces come in different sizes, some are long, some are short, and some have two combs, some have four combs. So you want to measure which ones. As you will see, I place different clip-ins on different parts of my hair in this video. And so between each clip-in um, piece, you want to make sure you put enough hair to cover the piece that you just installed. So you want to make sure you part enough, as you'll see me doing here. And as I get closer to the front here, I'm really paying attention to how much hair I leave out so I can make sure that I cover all of the extensions completely. And as you're working, it's, it's easy if you clip the hair that you're not using out of the way. That way you don't snag any pieces because you want to, um, if you're going to be wearing a part in your hair, you want to make sure that part looks nice and clean. And to me, I mean, it just is already blending very, very well. As you can see here, I didn't have any trouble blending these clip-in extensions with my natural hair. Um, they just blended perfectly, which I loved about that. The only thing I did was flat iron my hair a little bit more, more and put a little bit of um, Jamaican black castor oil on the top parts, as you'll see me do it in a second here. So as you see, you want to place the clip-in extensions as close to the part as you can. Um, that's going to make sure that the clip-in extensions are secure, and that's going to make sure that they um, are less detectable or, or not detectable at all. And then, like I have keep on mentioning, you want to make sure that you pull enough hair out that covers the track of the clip-in extensions. And so you see here, it's covering well, it looks very natural, it's blending very well. And so as I get to the top part here, what I did is you wanna place the extensions in the direction of the part and so since i'll be wearing a top ninja bun i placed the clips in the direction of the ninja bun if that makes sense you can kind of see in the video i placed it up in the opposite direction that i've been placing all the other extensions that way when i pull my hair up the um the track is undetectable as you'll see here in a minute as I begin to twist around and I just keep twisting and keep twisting all the way down and then after I've twisted all the way down that's when I begin to wrap to form the top ninja bun looks like a little cinnamon roll <laughs> I think it's just so cute and excuse my bald spot on my left side well, it's my right side, but it's your left. That's where my hair got pulled out. <laughs> but it's 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 getting there. <laughs> and 
And so after that, the only thing that I did was put a little edge control um, on my edges to smooth my edges down. Then I put a little JBCO um, on some parts of my hair. And then I went back through and flat ironed um, them so that it blended perfectly with the clipping extensions. Because since I'm natural, as soon as any bit of humidity hits my hair, I mean, it is already trying to revert back to its curly natural state. Alright, and that's pretty much it. Um, I just loved, loved, loved this look. Um, it's just very cute and adorable. I got this look from um, Lashante Heckard, which is one of my favorite people to just look at because she's so gorgeous. But um, here it is. Let me know if you have any questions. Um, and thanks so much for watching.